There we go. I'm gonna let up. What's up, everybody? I'm Evil Rabbit. We are here in Forza Horizon 4 in an M4 uh, to do something fun today because, well, let's just do it. Drift camera is now in Forza Horizon 4, so you know we're going to be ripping the toge in this M4 sideways with the drift cam on and uh, see how we do. The rain's not going to help. Definitely not used to the physics here in uh Horizon 4 but we are definitely going to uh go send oh I've been waiting for this now it is just turned on it is basically how it would be if you just turn it on I haven't tweaked it or anything so we're just gonna send it how it is see how it is and uh well here we go all or nothing Ooh. So much different, but so much cooler. I feel like I'm throwing too much angle because uh, I'm trying to get used to the camera. There we go. That's a little better. Oh my. Too much rotation. Ugh. Definitely. Takes a minute to get used to for sure. The tinted windows on this uh, M4 paint definitely not helping. But it's definitely so much cooler. Oh, to run these mountain roads with this drift camera. But I am not doing a very good job in this M4 right now. I'm a, oh, well. <clears throat> Nobody saw that. I would blame the fact that he's on paddles and I'm uh, actually using a shifter but uh, that would just be me making excuses so the feedback of my wheel has definitely changed since I updated it and I feel like it might be a little bit too much right now so I think we're gonna dumb that down a little bit That's a little better. Might have been a little bit too strong. Don't hit that car. Oh, just tap. So drift camera, Horizon 4. Definitely something that takes a minute to get used to. The rain is probably definitely not helping. But we will try and do better going downhill catch myself trying to throw too much angle I think because I want to see the camera rotate when I should just try and beat the turn yeah the tin windows not uh not working let's uh maybe change car up to a car that doesn't have tinted windows but still get sideways I'm gonna go Nissan Where'd you go? Mmm. My 370, my 350, or my S14, or my S13. Mmm. We're gonna rip the 350Z down. Well, this doesn't have window tint, so maybe it'll help out without having tint on the windows. Because I couldn't really see out that window when I was sideways in that M4. I know, I'm just making excuses, but. It is here, and uh, oh, I gotta get used to the right hand drive too. Oh, so much better to be able to see out the window when it's not tinted. So now we're gonna send it downhill, see what we can do as we grind the gear into third. All right, full send in the rain. So much better. Oh, 
That was not good. Turn around when it is safe to do so. Bogged down a little bit, but we're going to continue. So it's definitely going to take a little bit to get used to the drift camera, but I feel like it's going to make this that much more entertaining. I am struggling today to do anything correctly on this mountain. But we're still going to send it. Wow. Yep. Nope. No bueno. So if you guys are using the drift camera, let me know down in the comment section down below how you guys are enjoying it. Because uh, I'm just doing donuts here on the mountain because uh, I can't really drift right in this view. I swear, it's it's the view because go outside view. See, it's the view. I gotta get used to it. I throw too much angle in that view because I kind of want to see out the side window and I'm not actually doing the proper amount of counter steer or angle. That was a quick switch in view. It's a little better. It's not to be so aggressive on the angle. And we should be good. I feel like I could probably adjust it to make it work better for me. Now we're getting it. So we're going to go uphill and uh, see if we can't get the uphill better here in the Z with the new drift head cam, drift camera head motion, however they word it. Third gear flick in. We'll left up brake. That's better. Not trying to be super aggressive on the angle. That didn't help. Z is struggling to get uphill though. There we go. I think I got it now. Until the Z runs out of power. So much better on the third attempt on the uphill of this. Definitely gonna be playing more in this view here on Horizon as well as in Forza Motorsport 7. Definitely super excited that they brought this drift camera to Horizon. It's something I've been wanting for them to bring, especially for these tailgate runs. Now, if only they could do it for racing and look at Apex, it would be perfect. But, you know, we can't, uh, you know, beggars can't be choosers. We at least have this for drifting, so that's good. I would say get the wheel to rotate 900 degrees in the cockpit. That'd be nice, but no. Got another man down here running. Looks like Vaughn getting his car. Z is struggling. So I think the update to my force feedback on my actual Fanatec wheel has made the feedback feel a little bit different. So I'm going to have to fine tune and adjust that a little bit to get it how I want. This does feel pretty good right here, though. Camera does look good. I feel like I could tweak that a little bit more to make it fit my driving and look further so that maybe I won't throw as much angle. Because that's the reason I'm throwing so much angle is I want it to look further for me when it doesn't need to be. There we go. A freestyle section on the hill. Don't hit that. Don't hit the car. Oh, save it. Nope, didn't save it. I tried. So make sure you guys follow me on Instagram and Twitter, all of which are found in the description box below. Like I said, if you guys are using this, let me know what you guys set it at. Maybe uh, I should adjust the settings in this whole 
gearing change thing, Forza? You need to fix it. Please? Because I know I'm not grinding the gears. Well, that was nice. Oh, I forgot this was the drift zone. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this little video here on Horizon 4 trying to get back into it. That grass line, though. Definitely going to be doing some more here on the mountains with this camera view with some of the TUS guys as well as some of the OGs of the channel. Definitely going to have to tune another couple more cars because there's a lot of new cars out in, the, in this game that I definitely need to uh, get sideways in. So, as always, I like thank you guys for coming back and watching. We're going to ride it off into a tree. <laughs> I'm Evil Rabbit, and I will see you guys after this turn. Actually, I'll see you guys next time. There we go. Oh, too much.